What's up there fellow YouTubers, this is Chris from the Mars Anomalies channel. Just want to take a quick minute out. Uh, most of you have heard that uh, uh, Will from What's Up in the Sky 37, his dad passed away on the 31st uh, at the age of 66. Uh, from what I understand, he passed away in his sleep. Um, you know, um, I believe his name is William Henry Farrar. Uh, just want to uh, say my deep, deepest condolences uh, for my family to yours. Uh, and that's it. I mean, it's, uh, you know, it's a sad situation, and uh, I hope everything works out for you and the family there, Will. Um, all right, guys, uh, just wanted to let you guys know uh, I got a quick one for you today. Actually, I, got, I may have another one, too, just after this one, but I've got one here that's pretty quick. Now, this is either a vehicle or a building. Now, I'm swaying towards more because a vehicle because it doesn't appear to be that big if you look in relation to the actual rover itself, uh, Curiosity. So, but uh, I'm just going to click on it, and, uh, well, I'll show you if we can get it first, which is right here. This is, I believe, uh, yeah, uh, Sol 529, which is only two days ago. Um, well, it just says on the 14th, this is the 1st, so it was yesterday, according to them. Um, but, because we're up to the 31st now, so that's why it kind of threw me off. But anyway, this is it right here. Here's the your rover and everything else, and just so everybody knows, this is NASA JPL. Um, so, it's right there. Um, but then, you know, you can just go into full resolution, and there you are. Um, Kind of really freaky here, guys. I mean, here's the cool part. You don't even have to do anything to this picture if you don't want to. Um, all you got to do is zoom in. Um, it's uh, just, I mean, you just look around and you can just, well, here's your tire tracks and everything. But in the back, it is plenty of stuff to see. I mean, I want to lift, leave this up to you guys because there's some weird things going on in this picture, man. Um, and I want to show you in, um, the picture I have because I actually have it squared off and then squared off again where you guys can look at this stuff. But uh, uh, that'll be for the guys that like to dig. Um, because there's some weird things going on here. It looks like it could be more vehicles, structures, uh, and, and even at one point, right back here, that looks like there's some kind of, right from this land, and it looks like a bridge, so to speak, going all the way the heck across, and then it goes down to right here, and then it's just weird. I mean, you know, look, it's, it's actually going from here all the way across, and it goes down to here. Now, it looks like there's some kind of weird separation things. You'll see that a little bit better in a little bit. And this, if you really look at this picture, it looks like there's another vehicle way down here. And over on this part on the left, it looks like there's like sectioned off, almost like, when I say sectioned off, if you can picture, visualize a train sitting there. I'm not saying that's what it is, but it looks like there's sections of things, one after the other, like sitting right in here. So, and it looks like some kind of weird things going on here, either structures or vehicles. Um, and I'm going to show you right in this area, there's some more, it looks like there's three sitting there, but they're like camouflaged hiding in there. So, yeah. Um, I don't know if you guys see the anomaly right now. Um, that I'm speaking of, whether it be vehicle or, or structure. And like I said, I'm going to sway more to the structure, I mean the, the vehicle rather. Um, in the distance, perhaps it's hard to tell as far as being structures or vehicles. But um, you can look at this whole area right here. There's all this right here, and it's got a bunch of things in it. But uh, what I'm referring to is right here. You can see that. You don't even have to do the thing to this picture. I mean, I can, I mean, I still do it a little bit, but look at this. You can get the picture yourself. Um, there appears to be mechanical parts near it. But look at this right here. It actually, let me zoom in a little bit more because I know some of you guys uh, are watching this on small tablets and so on and so forth. But um, right here, nice radius coming around. And it does the same thing over here. It terminates right here, right here. Okay. It looks like there's either encrusted rocks or whatever else right here. But look at right here. Appears to be some kind of window. And right here doing the same. Look at nice and nice straight line, smooth. And if you look at the manipulation, it's got like going like this. You can literally still see the window going through that and going like this here. Okay, and then it kind of goes off here straight, and there's something sticking out of the roof pod or whatever the top of this thing is. Um, there's also, I can't, well, you can in a sense. You can see something's right here, too. It's got some kind of weird kind of piece this way, and then it's kind of an arched pod on this way, and it's sitting right on the ground here. But see how it's like it's gold, like you can see it, but it's like really kind of hidden. So it looks like it may be the rooftop of a maybe a smaller vehicle of some sort, because you can actually see in the front it's right here. Like, let's just say a hypothetical. This is the back window. Right here. And then maybe a small, let's say like a small car of some sort or some kind of small machine pod or something. But you can see if this was a back window, you can see through the back of it is like right here. Like this is, like if this was the windshield on the other side of this, and this goes down, the windshield would be in the front. You'd actually see the other part of it right there. There's one, two, and then you get the back window here, side window or whatever. But... There could be a machine pod. It could be anything. But this right here, kind of like, what? This is what I question, guys. This is what's really weird to me. And remember, I just got through saying you guys can look through the back here because there's a lot of stuff that's in here. There is stuff in this picture, okay? And like I said, for some reason, uh, 
um, well, I'll get back to that thought in a second. But see how, like, like I said, right here you're gonna see like a bunch of things like all lined up. I don't know what they are, but they're there. But you can see it like the, the land kind of stops or just kind of goes down here. But right from here over, there's this weird line going all the way down, comes down here, and this, you can see where it's like just lines. You can just see it there. But there's something in there. There's something way in here. It looks like another vehicle of some sort, almost like a it's like kind of shaped like a van per se. Um, I'm not saying that's what it is. I'm just saying it has that shape of one. Um, uh, like like a newer ones, like the caravan, stuff like that, so on and so forth. But it also appears that there's one, two, like, round circles there. Looks like it might be vehicles. There's another one right there next to it. You can actually see the outline of that one. One, two wheels. Comes up, goes back down. Let me see if we can get in more on this. But you can see this pretty good. There's one. You can see the roof. Boom, 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 boom. Circle, circle, and it stops right there. There's another one right here. One, two wheels. There's a bunch of stuff in here, guys. I mean, take a look at it. I mean, don't get me wrong. It's really hard to see the detail in there. So don't take me serious as far as this part here goes because um, I'm not really sure. But this right here struck me as a bridge at first. But then when you look at it, you say, okay, no, wait a minute. Maybe that's just a landscape. And there's just a bunch of things sitting on there. And it's the shape of those is what's thrown off and giving you this illusion of some kind of weird bridge. But I don't know. Um, like I said, I mean, it just goes right from here. And you can just see like separations in between there. Or again, it's just stuff that's on the landscape. But it kind of seems a little odd that it's completely straight across here. I mean, look at that. I mean, come on. Um, but like I said, jump, jump over here to the side. This is what puzzles me. Why is this side so hard to see anything? And I'll show you the other three things that are hiding in here. And um, I think believe it's like in here, one over here, I think. Let me just do this here. Um, there's like one in here somewhere, one over here, and there's another over here, something like that, dug in the dirt. And you'll see the difference in the pictures. I mean, they just change them every time you look. But... Why are those so hard to find, but yet they, they put this one right out in the open? Like, they don't even go out of their way to hide it. It's almost like, the, you know, uh, like I said, there is an inside guy that's actually just throwing us a bone once in a while. Hey, if he is doing that, now, I'm not saying he's catering strictly to me. He may be just putting it out there and just saying, hey, anybody want to grab this picture, go ahead. But I'm looking at this thing, and I'm going, oh, my God, if that don't look like a vehicle. It's like buried in the, in the gravel in, the, in this little hillside. I mean, there's clearly something there. Um, and you can just see it. Like I said, it's just like here. Comes around, nice, nice arch curvature, stops right there, just like this side does. But like you can see, like with all this gravel and stones and everything else here, and whatever this is next to it. But you can see right here, comes down, comes over here, nice and smooth radius around here. And like I said, they got something manipulated right here, kind of goes down. You can see like a like a haze line, but you can still see that corner, of that window coming down, and it goes over to here. But here's the wild part too, from here over, it goes down. See the straight line goes down. Goes behind this rock here, but it looks like it kind of loops around right here. See that? I don't know what that is, but there's something there. There's clearly there's something there. There's something sticking out like a little triangular shape, something or other. But to me, I'm going, why would they leave that there, but yet go out of their way to hide it? And this is the closest thing to this machine. I mean, I don't. I mean, look at how far do you think that is? I mean, you can see they're using the uh, uh, the has cams because it would be like the equivalent or on your bumper of your own vehicle. It's that low um, where your nav and your uh, mass cams are at the on the top of the um, mast itself um but i mean i can see that just sitting there i mean i don't even have to i mean anybody who looks for details can see that with ease so i mean you know guys tell me what you think i mean and then like i said i'm going to show you this right now um and this is what i've got i'm going to jump it right in let's go 300 percent for the heck of it all righty and there it is right there now of course this is not right from the actual uh page itself so you're going to have a little pitch of degradation but let's do this Okay, this you can actually see it just like popped out a little bit more. Okay, let's get rid of some of the the actual because uh, you can see right here is where it's more grainy, more blur than re, you know resharpen. Not quite as bad, but see it right there, right there. Now I believe this is longer. This vehicle is actually longer. It's underground, um, but that's just me. I, I'm just saying that because you can just clearly see you don't you don't see this whatever this whole thing is. So I believe it's actually in the ground. It's still in the ground here, but you can see this. Like I said, just look right here. You can see this weird pixelation white blur stuff, but you can see the window actually goes down below that. And then you get this weird thing that comes down. And it looks like it, there's a rock sitting here, but it looks like this thing comes around and there's loops around it. So I don't know what that is, but there's something clearly there. I don't, I'm not sure, but it looks like, I mean, if I was to say vehicle or structure, I'd have to go vehicle. Because it looks like it'd be something similar, like the size of the, the rover or a hair bit bigger. Because they say the rover is only like a... Like a small SUV, the size of one anyway. Um, okay. Now, this is the part I'm going to let you guys... I'm just going to do a rough, real quick thing to this area here. Um, and you can see where I, I've looped it there. Uh, well, just kind of put up the area we'll be looking at. 
And of course, you guys can go over here as well, too. But um, now let me just equalize. Okay. Now, you can see where st stuff is starting to pop out. I said, well, it looks like there's one car here, one car here. And all of a sudden, this line is starting to get darker here, too. See it? All the way down. All the way down. Now, that actually goes past this. So that's why I thought maybe, maybe the vehicles can go up on this road here. Or is that a road at all? Is it just a horizon? I don't know. Because it looks like there may be things sitting there. And then that just happens to be the edge. But why is the horizon so darn straight? I mean, it just doesn't make any sense. Okay. So let me just blur that up. Now, see how it just has this line here? It goes all the way down. and actually kind of goes right down to here. And there's something in the back here, too. Like it goes up. So I don't... See, that like there's weird separations and stuff right here. And there's something underneath that. Um, not sure what that is, but it's it's there. Now, like I said, it looks like you can see things right here. And is these are what I was talking about in the back here. Look at one on the left-hand side. is one, two, three, four, five. Can't make out what the rest of that is. So I don't know if these are vehicles on a, all in a row. And this happened to be like another stretch of road or something. Because I'm going to show you this right now. And check this out. Now, let me do this real quick. Because, again, I know you guys. some of you guys are using these little... Uh, tablets and smaller devices. The only problem with it is, man, everything just gets really pixelated. I hate doing that to a picture. Um, but again, there's one, two, three, four, five. It looks like you might be able to see a little something there, but it's hard to tell that one. But um, And then, like I said, look at this way, the way this comes off this piece of land. If you look at this land, it just looks like it just comes all the way nice straight right there. And it looks like it's got like, I can't tell if that space is underneath it or if there's actually things right there. And it's kind of like thrown off the just the back because it looks like see how it looks it looks like a bridge here it looks like it comes down, but there's something there so I can't tell what that is. I, I don't know it's crazy, but it'll give you a little something to look at because I want to look at this a little better myself. But these appear to be other little vehicles of some sort in here mixed around, and then I want to show you guys this here. I can figure what this is. All right, there's one right here. Okay, and you can see like different different parts of like an arch right here. There's something right there. There's something right here that's one, two, three. It's like right in this area here. It's like buried right here. Okay. Let me see if I can't blur it up and be shopping or normalize it a little bit. Okay. And then there's one right here. See that? Kind of goes around something like that. And it looks like it's got some kind of weird where the person and occupant would sit or something like that. Or it's some kind of weird, funky piece of machinery or something. I don't know. Um, but like I said, right here, it's like buried in the ground. Right here, there's something. But you can see how they blended this thing to really get rid of it. And I'm not surprised. I mean, come on. Um, that's just the way NASA's good like that. Um, okay. So you guys check this thing out. Let me know what you think. I didn't want to make this one too long. Um, I did want to show you this other... Uh, I mean, like I said, I don't know why they would go out of their way to hide all of this stuff back here. Of course, it is the you know piss-poor, low-quality picture. Um, and then this one's like, boom, right there in your face. Um, so I like the idea of that. That, to me, says it just... It just definitely screams, you know, intelligently made. I mean, come on. Like I said, just, just I don't know, just, just the shape of this thing. Um, and like I said, it's symmetrical because you see where it terminates right here. Then it goes all the way around, comes to there, same exact thing. And then it has these what look like windows, but you can't see right here. And then you can just, like I said, it goes behind this little blurred out area. Like they try to manipulate it to try to hide this thing. So and it's got this other piece going down. It looks like it goes behind this rock and loops around. And some of the mechanical pots here, you can just see that stuff. And like I said, I don't know what this is right here. It's got that weird archway. And then you can see through what I, if, like I said, if it's a small car or some kind of machine, you can see like the other half of like this would be the pillar going down to the, the windshield would be on that side and the side windows would be on this side. And you can just see through the back. It's like another part of that front window. I don't know. But it just has this weird shape to it. It's just... Um, and when I docking it up, I do that purposely. It does distort the picture, but it makes this pop a little bit better. See how it's like right there? And then it goes over to around. And you got that other one right here. It looks like the rooftop of some small other vehicle. I, I can't make out. And this right here, look at this white right thing. It has this double hump thing going on. There's another one here, another one here. And there's something in the background here. There's, there's, there's clearly some pots strewn around in here. I mean, it's just mechanical pots. Um, at least that's the way it appears to me. But uh, I'll let you guys jump on that, and you tell me. Um, there it is again. And like I said, I can zoom right into that because that seems a little bit clearer. Um, so we'll do that. I mean, tell me what you think. I mean, you know, like again, uh, this is that little... Now this is, you know, might say, well, that might be a real tiny car. I don't know about that. If we're sitting here and this is the Hascam, that's still a little bit of a distance away to way over there. I mean, that may be only 8 to 10 feet away or 20, even let's let's throw 20 feet at it just for craps and giggles. But 
if you look in relations how, how how a person is how large it is this particular wheel they're pretty big so this is probably not more than eight ten feet away or maybe let's throw 15 to 20 at it tops um let's say 20 just for argument's sake um yeah that would that'd be about right this thing is clearly either the size of this rover or a little bit bigger if you would have moved this rover up to it you know what i mean so um yeah it's hard to tell but anyway guys uh, just figured I'd do a quick one for you guys, let you know um, I'm really on top of this stuff. Like I said, that was on uh, Solve 529. It was only a couple of days ago. Well, according to that, it's a one day ago, but um, either way, they call it the Solve was 529. Um, but I got another one coming up for you, too. It's like this kind of in-your-face kind of weird things, and uh, I'm going to share that one with you guys as well. So you guys, hey, again, uh, always appreciate you guys watching, um, you know, uh, like I said before, I mean, I, I can't say it enough. You guys are great as far as the subscribers. Um, you guys are on this thing hardcore. That's why I'm kind of giving you guys the opportunity to look at this stuff here as well um, and see what you pull out of it. Because I get ideas what they are, and they're just so vague at times. But sometimes somebody may just see it at a different angle and catch onto it faster or just say, hey, this is what I see. And then I'll go, wow, yeah, I'll be darned. I didn't see it. I didn't see that. But not that this video here was cool nonetheless. Give me your take on it. Uh, is it a uh, you know structure, vehicle? You guys tell me, all right? Anyway, guys, appreciate watching, and I will see you next pick.